Hey you guys, welcome in to the channel. I hope everybody is having an amazing day. All right, let's get into it. For your sign for Leo season, welcome in if you guys are new. Welcome back if you're returning. Okay. I feel like expect a good outcome and there will be a good outcome, okay? There is somebody that wants to fight about it, but just know that you have the upper hand or you have the advantage here, okay? If you guys are new, welcome. If you're returning back, welcome back, okay? We have the Ten of Swords and we have the Hierophant, okay? This is, could be some something revolving around a contract that was ended or let go or somebody that was released uh, recently from a job, okay? Or someone who you got into an argument with okay it's like they still i don't know i feel like for some reason for somebody you've gotten into it with someone and they still are talking about you even though you haven't said anything about them you don't went on your merry way you ain't even thinking about these people and they still continue to have your name in their mouth like they use you as a rebuttal for everything and you're like dude <laughs> i have nothing to do with that okay For the sign, excuse me, for the season of Leo, you guys, I'll pull the sign that this reading is for at the end, okay? Six of Pentacles here. There's somebody coming in that wants to pack fair with you. It's like, they like, look, I'm going to pack fair with you. I'm going to tell you the real. I'm going to tell you the truth. Or I'm going to do right by you. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be loyal. I'm going to be faithful. Confirmation with the horn going off. Okay. That's what it is. Somebody's coming in like, I commit to you, okay? I commit to you. Any of that other stuff, you ain't got to worry about that, <laughs> okay? You don't even got to worry about that. Like, I'm indebted to you. I com commit to you. I'm all yours, okay? This person, like, they like, I'm all yours, okay? The death and rebirth card. This is going to have to do with the Scorpio. Cancer of Pisces, King of Cups is here, okay? Somebody, they, they, they got it. This person... Like on a spiritual level, um, on an emotional level, they know what it is that they want. Like there's no confusion. It's clear. Um, they're, they've gotten enlightenment about it. This person could have prayed about you. They could pray for you. This person's like got it together. They know how to center themselves and ground their energy. They know what is required. This person's willing to do the work. Okay. They want to give just as much as you want to give to it. This is somebody that's actually going to invest just as much as you do in the situation, okay? Whether this is like in a work setting or a relationship setting, this is like, I'm going to put in just as much time and effort as you, okay? You don't have to worry about you being giving more and being an overgiver. You don't have to worry about any codependency. This person's like, no, I'm going to pull my weight. I'm going to give you your space. We're going to make this thing work, Okay? I feel a harmonious energy here is the center of this all. Somebody is wanting peace, not war. Okay, they don't want to argue. This person don't even like to argue. Okay, it's the level of respect that is here. I feel like that you both hold for each other. And you guys are both, looks like you guys are both praying people here. The Hierophant and the King of Cups. Both are seated in a position where a prayer is like giving honor, giving respect. Now, it's any, like they left somebody out. They ended it with this Five of Pentacles energy. They ended it with this. They cut this Five of Pentacles out of their life. They don't have a lack mentality. They don't have anybody uh, codependent on their energy. They they cut out some type of codependency. Okay. They release that. They're like, nah, I'm done with that. Somebody feels abandoned by this person. Okay. You look, and they took a new leap in a new direction here. Page of Pentacles. Okay. The Fool and the Page of Pentacles. This person's ready to take some type of leap. Like, I'm hearing that song. This person's ready to walk that mile with you. I'm hearing that song by Adele, one and only. This person is worthy. I'm just hearing that. I dare you to let me be your one and only. I promise I'm a worthy to hold in your arms. So come on and give me the chance to prove I am the one who can, yeah, walk that mile. That's what I'm hearing. 
until the end of time. They want to walk this mile with you until the end of time. The Page of Swords is in the reverse. They don't, they're not trying to figure it out. They're in the energy of the King of Cups. The King of Cups is highly enlightened, okay? This person's listening to their intuition. They're being spiritually guided, and God is telling them to come towards you. God is telling them or has already told them, like, you're the one. I'm hearing that song. You're the one that I love. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Shout out to, is it Trump? John Travolta? Somebody could wear their hair like John Travolta. Somebody could dress like John Travolta. Somebody's name could be John. Somebody's name could be Travolta. Somebody drives a Traverse. Somebody's name is Travis. I'm hearing Unique. I'm hearing Diamond. I'm hearing Express. Oh, okay. Somebody could be getting you a custom-made ring, a custom-made diamond. Okay, I am compassion. This compassion, this person's committing to you. Do you see that right there? That dove is kind of carrying a ring. They ain't coming with no, they're like, no, I'm dedicated. They know your royalty. I am compassion. That's your affirmation. A ladybug is here. You could be seeing a lot of ladybugs. Something about the Mother Isis read that I did uh, this weekend. Okay, it's significant. Somebody here could be a high priestess, very intuitive, very empathic, highly spiritual or spiritually enlightened. That could be you or your person. It's like they don't need to do any more research. They don't need to, they don't need to, they, this person is sure. I'm sure it's you. I'm sure it's you. How she say, don't need to convince me otherwise. Uh, my heart belongs to you. Y'all could both be sure that it's y'all. <laughs> He's like, you're the one that I love. John Travolta vibe. And then the, you're over here, Shea Frazier. I'm sure it's you. Okay, so this song already came out for another sign. I keeps on falling in love. Sunday Fun Day by LMI and Babyface. But let's see if we can get another song. One that hasn't come out. Okay, we got Missy Elliott Drip Demeanor is the one that I'm drawn to. Okay, Drip Demeanor. I can't hold me till your body starts to feel. Put that thing on me. Can you put it in sleep? Do me that. Somebody can't wait. Like, they cannot wait to have you or be with you or I feel like make it, make it, what's the word that I'm looking for? <sighs> make it legit. That's not really what I'm wanting to say. It's another word, but I can't think of it right now. They can't wait, though. This person can't wait to be with you or have you. Make it. Maybe it is make it legit. An Ophelicus could be significant. You could be a divine warrior. A warrior could be significant. You can consider yourself this warrior, or they do. What is the word I'm looking for? They can't wait to make it... I don't know. It won't come out. <laughs> Scorpio. All right. Scorpio, this has been your reading. I hope that you enjoyed. And um, I just feel like they can't wait to make it legit, like final or something. This has been your read, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll catch y'all next time. Bye, Scorpio.